What's going on all my beautiful subscribers? Today we've got some Battlefield 4 PlayStation 4 gameplay, so make sure to, if you really do enjoy it, you know, leave a like. You know, that's what we're looking for, guys, because this is some rocking gameplay. This is the first game of Team Deathmatch that I ever played on Battlefield 4, so it's definitely not the best, but I do top the leaderboard, so it's pretty good. But today, way more important than that, it's Father Sunday, Dad Duel Commentary. Introduce yourself. Hey, what is up, Warriors? It's the Quad Father here. And today I was reading and I saw three amazing stories and I wanted to bring them to you. I, I like amazing stories. Okay, the first one has, has to do with Best Buy and the good deals they have there. They do. And then uh, another a football fight. Mm hmm. I, and I then, love fights. And then a double D, <laughs> double D haircut. Double D. Oh, okay. All right, so let's start with uh, you know, Thanksgiving. All right, Best Thanksgiving Buy had happened. some great deals, right? Mm -hmm. Black Friday or. Uh, Brown Thursday. Brown Thursday. It's called Thanksgiving, but yeah. okay. Brown <laughs> Thursday for those people doing some shopping out there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Best Buy had some deals. Matter of fact, you went to Best Buy on Thanksgiving night, didn't you? Yeah, I, I did. I mean, I thought, why not? I'm not really doing too much at that time. You know, we, we went over to your parents' house or my grandparents, and yeah. we went out there. We, we had dinners. We usually do. Had fun for a few hours, and then and then we came back. And you and got sick of like, family, and so you went yeah, to the shopping. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I did. Yeah. And what'd you mm -hmm. pick up? Well, I picked up actually Battlefield 4 because oh, the game oh, that you guys are watching. Right I picked it up and I picked up Rise for the Xbox One, which really isn't more of a YouTube kind of, you know, it's a YouTube game, I guess. But sure. it, it, if this were to come out on the Xbox 360, it wouldn't be a YouTube game. It's a good game. It's a yeah, great it game. I was looking for a third person game that I actually enjoyed and that Rise seemed to fulfill my my answers. So, it's your uh, bloodlust, man. They, those mm -hmm. I was I was playing it. You bleed all over the place. Oh yeah, just You're like World of War. Yeah, yeah, slicing guys' heads off and everything. <laughs> all right. So another guy, he was in Florida. He went to Best Buy for those Thanksgiving deals, and um, he went in and and he was shopping, and mm -hmm. apparently someone saw a baby in his car. Okay, and, and he left him out there, or left the baby out there. Well, it's, so they went into the Best Buy and they said, "Hey, anybody driving the truck or whatever?" No response, yeah. and so finally they broke the window. And uh, well, it, how, how long after? Do you know how long? Yeah, ten, about 10, 15 minutes after someone spotted the, the child. That's weak, dude. It should've, they should have <laughs> waited at least 30. What? How, how long what? could a baby? How long how old, the baby is, is, is the, the child like six months? Two months. Like, two, two months. Are old. you sure? Yes, two months. Uh, I read it. All right. Well, it's winter. Okay. <laughs> yeah, and so they broke, the, they broke the car window and got the baby mm -hmm. out. Well, of course, the guy, guy got arrested for felony child neglect. Oh, my God. What? No, that's lame. You're I'm not allowed. You I'm can't out. lock your child I'm, I'm in the moving car to Canada. while you go to shopping at Best Buy. I'm coming to Canada. Here I come. <laughs> oh yeah, it's it's an anarchy here, boy. You never know why you might be arrested. Oh, the yeah. interesting what thing was <laughs> his excuse was, well, I thought the baby was with my wife. Well, I I can see that. Oh sure, you're not a parent. I think you know whether you buckle a child in the car and take him to the store with you. Oh, okay, but you but think he, he did, did it on purpose? Yeah, he did get an Xbox One. So okay, you know, yeah. So I friended him. <laughs> we'll be playing together. No. no. <laughs> okay, yeah. so that that's story number one. All right, story number two is it just about a football game that well, happened. Wait, like, wait, do you think he went to jail? Yeah, he did go to jail. Well, really? he was arrested for. Okay, felony. so he probably either got a very large. Family. Well, it also depends on where he lives. Yeah, and a lot of child support. All right. <laughs> that's the thing. Yeah, All exactly. right. So, okay, so you played football with your friends just down at the park, just a mm -hmm. bunch, of, bunch of kids just, just hanging hang out. Yeah. 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 Well, okay. One, one kid, boy, who's 13 years old, he was playing football down at the park with his buddies. It was in Oregon. Mm -hmm. that's and, he, and he came home after and uh, told his dad that while he was playing, he got elbowed in the face. All right. Yeah. Yeah, kind of. Well, you're playing football, right? I mean, what do you, it, yeah, you're playing it, one of the most contact sports. Yeah, it's not croquet. Yeah, exactly. We're not we're not playing golf here. No, no, it's a, it definitely is a contact sport. Well, mm -hmm. the dad, he didn't take too kindly to that, so he marched down to the park with his son <laughs> to confront the children that they were playing with. Mm, and what he say? He said, "All right, so who elbowed who elbow, elbowed my kid in the face?" And the kid said, "Well, it wasn't me, but you know, it was this guy over here." And the dad cold cocks the thirteen year old. Cold cocks. That's not sorry. Knocked him out. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Why? Th not even the guy who. That's no, the... not even the guy who who elbowed his kid. Oh, just, just the other the... kid who was talking to him. Why? That... Well, Does you know, his dad have something wrong with him. You know, in a, well, maybe, but All you know, right. in America, <laughs> in America, you're innocent until proven guilty, and, uh -huh. and you can see by this picture right here that I can tell an innocent guy just by looking at him, and and this guy is clearly innocent. Really? Wait, wait. Which guy? The guy who punched the kid? Yeah, the dad is clear. I mean, look at a picture of him. He's he's <laughs> he's a good guy. Oh you yeah, know? you can tell. He, he he did get charged with second degree assault. I'm not a third degree. Give me all the degrees. <laughs> First degree would be worse. Oh really? Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Um, First degree then. And had twenty five thousand dollars in bail. Ooh, I'm not surprised. I'm sure he got bailed, but 
Uh, uh, yeah. No. I, I, you why? know what? I love you very much, son. You don't love me twenty five thousand dollars, though. Uh, not not at one spot, because I'm sure you're <laughs> much more expensive than twenty five thousand dollars overall. Matter of fact, I think it's something like seven hundred thousand dollars is what it costs to raise a kid. Really? Yeah. All right. I, I can but, see it. Oh yeah, it's easy for you to say. You're the kid. <laughs> you know what? I'm I, making what I, like triple that off YouTube. <laughs> when I started doing the math, I'm like. He better be a damn good kid. Cause, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if he's worth three quarters of a million. Oh, yeah, I, I will. But, you, sure. are. but already, you are. I've already made triple that. And I'm going to get it back, right? You're gonna, yeah. You're going to pay me back. Of course. I'll pay you double back. Everything's just a loan, pretty much. Mm -hmm, yeah. mm -hmm. so of course. Long, that's the way we work. <laughs> as long as I get it back. All right. So now, this is mm -hmm. this is a story. I love stories. That comes from Colorado. And uh, this gal was advertising that she was cutting hair. And so she advertised right, yeah. on the internet. Mm -hmm. and, uh, that's how you it, do it? Yeah. Well, it's a $45 haircut. Ooh, they they better be, they yeah. Better be cutting my hair, right? So this dad says, "All right, I'm going to take my kid down there and, uh, you know, give give get a haircut for him." Yeah, of course. Okay, so give him the finest haircut in all the land. <laughs> you know what? Actually, I used to pay a fair amount for a, for a haircut when um when I was living in L.A. I was like 21 years old, and they actually would give you a drink while you were there. Yeah, like oh, I, I've heard that uh, on Painkiller already. The podcast with like Woody and Wings and all them. And Wings talks yeah, about I how he went to a, a a fine. What's it called? Like a a master cutsman or a, a master I, debater? What, no, no <laughs> masturbator. Oh. But uh, well, what's the what's the like the the word for uh, who's a, a, a professional person that cuts your hair? Uh, barber. Okay, like a, a master barber. I think. Okay, yeah, I think it sounds here. like a master barber. He went to one of those, and they like they shave your beard, and they like oh, I yeah. don't know. It's really like pleasant. He says so. Oh yeah, well yeah. I haven't I haven't had anybody shave my beard. I had my toenails painted at a, at a <laughs> salon one time. I, I remember that. Yeah. Well, I, you know, I figure I wear shoes all the time. Besides, they, it didn't even cost any oh, more oh, money. Oh wait, wait. Did your husband too? Oh, but a bang. A boom roasted. Oh, th thank you. Yes, your dads love you very much. <laughs> Jeez. No, right, I, I got it done. I got it done. I got a little jewel I, I, I on the end. I want to hear this guy. I want to know why he paid forty-five dollars. Okay. Okay. So he goes down there, mm -hmm. and uh, turns out that right as he got there, the lady got arrested. Why? Well, she was giving topless haircuts. Oh. Which actually is not illegal. <laughs> oh. Why matter did she get arrested then? Matter of fact, I think it should be more common. I mean, yeah. Why not? I, of I get my haircut every. Couple, uh, every day, yeah. A couple days, yes. But but how come she got arrested? Well, it wasn't for... Because mo in most cities, women can be topless because it's the Wait, same as men. Where we live? Yes, yes. No. Yes, yes. No. Yes. No, you're a liar. I'm not lying. I want the facts. I want you the can be topless. It's legal. It's legal for a woman to be topless in California and New York. Just and all anywhere. Kinds of, yes. Matter why, of fact, why does it a, never happen? It does happen. I've never seen it. I don't well, go outside. Never. You're not hanging out in the right places, I guess. I just don't go outside. <laughs> yeah, exactly. They don't come to you. Yeah, yeah. No, really. There's there's a day. I don't know. It's I saw it on the internet just a little bit ago where where people go down and they meet at the city park and they're topless. And, I've never heard of it. Yeah. Well, I, I've seen pictures and, and and I think they should keep their tops on. <laughs> Most if of them probably. Yeah, because it's like at a nudist colony. You know, none of the people you want to be <laughs> oh, naked yeah, of or course, actually of naked. Course, it's yeah. all the, uh, that's that's all it how that's that's just how it works it's out. It's the old fat people like me that you yeah, know, old you, fat your, people. Your eyes burn and Mr. go to the gym every day. You start weeping when you see him you're like, of course no, put it back on put it back on <laughs> no so this dad took his his kid down there and and he didn't even get a haircut so, oh, was, lame. Did, so did he pay no, no so do i have do i have time for one quick little bonus story here of course dude we got time for days this is Our, battlefield 4 boy. oh that's right this very slow paced game I, it, it, okay the, when you play team deathmatch which yeah. is the game that i'm playing it like sections off like a tenth of the map and it's awesome Oh, it's okay, fun. so it's, it's much smaller like, maps. I, well, I, I mean, of course, Call of Duty is still, no matter what, going to be more action-paced, but right. still Team Deathmatch on Battlefield 4, this thing's rocking. Do you I, like, I love it. Do you like uh, driving the vehicles or flying a helicopter or You can't like in Team Deathmatch, but uh, oh, in okay. every other game mode, I believe, besides Team Deathmatch, you can. And, dude, driving, like, ATVs and tanks, that's so much that fun. That is kind of, it feels like GTA a little bit. Uh, yeah, I turn kind of turn into a racing game for me. Yeah, uh, okay. So <laughs> No, 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 Battlefield 4 did. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, so, um, but there's no kill streaks or anything, right? I don't believe so. All right. Okay, so uh, I know sometimes you're not the biggest fan of your teachers, right? Yeah, sure. I, I have a few that I like and most that I dislike, but yeah. there, there are a few out there. Because yeah. they make you work. Mm -hmm. Well, one student, uh, <laughs> while, while uh, his teacher turned around and was writing on the board, mm -hmm. um, he lit her on fire with a lighter. What? Yeah, she didn't get hurt. Nobody got hurt here, but he actually lit her sweater <laughs> or shirt on fire. And, and uh, are we sure we know it's that kid? Well, yeah, yeah, actually, because, oh. cause, well, one thing that gave him away was he threw the lighter out the window and took off running. 
Oh, so he, he turned kinda, off running. Yeah, he roasted if he just himself. Threw the, yeah, he, he self roasted, man. I mean, <laughs> if he just lit her on fire and then just you know just casually like looked away and freaked out. Yeah, dude. It worked. Yeah, exactly. He freaked out, tried to put her out or something. Should have like done that. it. I I think you should have done it, man. Come you on, know, you're probably watching this video too. Step up your lighting teacher on fire game. <laughs> no, no, no. You Step know what? The, I, like I've I've thrown a when I was in high school, I threw a ball of paper at other people in of class course, and yeah. things like you that. You just mess but, around, yeah. But I didn't light any teachers on fire. Yeah, I, mean, I typically try to stay away from lighting. Lighting my um, uh, I want I want to use a different word from right? teacher. I want to use my instructor. Instructor. Okay, but not instructor. I don't want to use like professor. Not a professor. Someone who's like. Mm, I'm out. Okay, whatever, teacher. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't know. I just, I, I try to sound. The boss of the classroom. The boss of the classroom, right? Yes. I, don't light the boss on fire in any situation. Yeah, that, pretty much words to live Unless by. the I, boss is Hitler. I have a bumper sticker actually that says that. Don't the, don't light the boss on fire. Oh, yeah, of course. I, I thought I was the only one. <laughs> yeah, well, you don't drive yet. Maybe. Except for in uh, Battlefield 4. Mm -hmm, that's my favorite place to drive. Okay, well, that's all the stories I have for you today. All so. right, I think that's going to wrap up this episode of Father Sunday. We'll be seeing you guys. Well, of course, you guys will be seeing me tomorrow, but we'll also be seeing my dad and I on Wednesday for our advice series. So you guys can go ahead if you want to have, if you have any questions, we're here to answer them. Just inbox me on YouTube. Maybe you guys can tweet them at me this time if you want to. Uh, of course, I always keep you uh, anonymous. That's just basically something yeah. that I always do. But make sure to leave a like rating on this video. That's going to help us out. That gets us some exposure, helps us, helps us go somewhere yeah. with all the hard work that we put it in make sure to subscribe if you're new guys if you haven't seen all the other videos that i've been posting they're always there on my channel make sure to check out my social media links in the description below my dad's twitter will be there too he needs some followers guys come on step up your game it's been quantum ft and the quad father and we'll be seeing you guys in tomorrow or you'll be seeing me in tomorrow's video and wednesday will be seeing my dad and i see you guys later see you at the barbershop